world and Paralympic champion goes in this in lane six alongside his compatriot David Henson. It's a great field. Here's Daniel Wagner Jorgensen of Denmark. Has previously got us Daniel Jorgensen, now Daniel Wagner, a bit like John Cougar Mellencamp. Great long jumper, gold in the uh, Europeans, also snowboarder. This is David Henson. Silver in the 200 meters in Grosseto at the European Championships. The three-time world champion, Paralympic champion over 200 meters. Flex those muscles over the line in London. He's getting practice in. Richard Whitehead for Great Britain. Rigus Woods of the United States, the reigning Pan Am long jump champion, bronze in the long jump at the Worlds. First major championship at the IPC level for Ntando Malango of South Africa, athlete of the Iowa's under 23 World Games in Prague last year. Here's the Pan Am champion, Shaquille Vance of the United States, based in Chula Vista, Canada, is coach Joachim Cruz, that 800 meters Olympic champion, LA 84. The Asian Games champion, it's Anil Prasanna Jalayath Yoda, pedigree of Sri Lanka, serves in the army, gold in the 200 in the Asian Games. And his colleague also in the army, Unel Indika Chilada Abarana Gadara, bronze in the one and two in the Asian Games. And they're in a brilliant relay team as well. So Whitehead, by far the man to watch. He gets in his stride past the bell, and he went pretty much from last to first, famously, brilliantly, in his home Paralympic Games in London. Aparana Kadara in one, Yoda Pedigi in two, Vance in three, Malangu four, Woods five, Whitehead six, Henson seven, Wagner Jorgensen in eight. The final of the men's 200 meters, T42. And away they go, Wagner Jorgensen well into his stride. Whitehead will take a while to get going, and Henson as well, but now Whitehead will straighten up and go for home. Vance going well for the United States. Here comes Richard Whitehead for Great Britain, on his way to defend his title, and also Malanga for South Africa. Whitehead's going to get the gold, he'll defend it. 23-3-9. Malangu gets the silver. Vance and Henson up there for the bronze, but Whitehead successfully defends his crown. He's got the gold again. Maybe he wanted a faster time, but he's the Paralympic champion once more. Malangu second, 23-7-7 with a new African record. And Richard Whitehead, glory in London in 2012, and he's a world championship to aim for as well. Gold and bronze for Britain because Henson got that and he's realized it now. It was a tight finish for the bronze, but the race for gold, anything but tight. One for the Blade Runners. What a spectacular race to watch as they wind it up in the straight. Once they negotiate the bend, the Blades really go to work. And it was, of course, Whitehead who was able to put them to best use, as he so often does. It was a brilliant start from Shaquille Vance of the United States. He was probably leading after 15, 20 metres. But it was this man, Richard Whitehead, coming down the straight. Very tight for third. And Henson has got there ahead of Shaquille Vance. 24.74 for Henson, 24.86 for Vance. So Vance in lane three, immediately up on the inside of a couple of runners, three in fact. Whitehead second from the outside as you look at them now. And then Henson will come home strongly. Now Whitehead hits top gear and he's joined by Malangu of South Africa. Whitehead powerfully to the line. Points to the crowd and a withering finish offered by David Henson to get himself the bronze medal. Yeah, when he straightens up, Whitehead is just a joy to watch. It's such a smooth style. And Henson very much emulating that. In fact, Henson 
reminded me very much of Whitehead's run at London 2012. You see why they're so strongly built upstairs, because the arms do a lot of work in this classification. He is absolutely pumping the top half of the body. And Henson gallops across to get the bronze medal. Yeah, got the guns out in London 2012, wanted a different celebration this time. And he's got it, and he's got another goal. He's 40 years old now, but it's the Olympic Stadium in London where next year's World Championships are going to be in July. <laughs> yeah, OK, there is the celebration back, but not on the line this time. He is a brilliant champion, Richard Whitehead. Takes the goal this time, 23-39.